All right, so we spotted an elephant. It's just on the road here. Just go past it fast. Go, 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 go. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to day six of the Choc Choc Tournament. So we had a bit of bad news this morning. So yesterday we used our potion to get the double points for the whole entire day. Um, but there was some quests that we did this, which were around this area. And when we went to them, they were closed. So those ones that we went to around this area were rejected and they were big points too. So which means we missed out on a few of those points. And for some reason, a lot of our other photos got rejected because it didn't meet the standards. Um, <laughs> we, we watched one of their videos. They do like a daily recap video um, every few days. And apparently that Fountain of Youth that I went in a couple of days ago, that was the sewage line. I don't know how it was. I swear to God, the guy said that was the Fountain of Youth. You swim in there. But I don't reckon it was a sewage line because it seemed way too fresh. But yeah. Um, so today, right now, we're going to head back down to those couple we missed yesterday. And then we're going to head up and hopefully see some elephants. Because there's one main road we're going to go along. And apparently there's elephants along there. So let's see. Let's begin the day. Okay, so I'm in this place now called Cinema Village. So th we this is the place we come to yesterday, but it was closed and our points got rejected. So we have to come back and try to find a bus. But look how cool it is. So this is like an old town around here. And I just asked one of the guys, he said the bus is in the new town this way. But I need to find this bus, take a photo with it. And I, I'm gonna have to find it because we paid 1300 rupees for this ticket. So I don't want to come in here for nothing. Oh, and also, walking here, I was almost getting attacked by dogs. Freaking dogs are just like chasing after me. I have to run away. I'm good, I'm good. This, is that, is that the bus? Yeah, it's the bus. Yeah, it's huge. Is it? Is it a tram bus? Tram bus, cool. I found it. I found the bus. Look at it. It's huge. This, this is not, not any normal bus though. This is a tram bus. So when I was coming up along that street, there was like tram tracks. A double decker tram bus. I've never seen anything like that. How cool. All right, because we had to come back to this place, we're such in a big rush to get to every place we need to go to today. So I'm going to run back. Oh, we got it. It was so far away. I literally just ran back that way. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we're heading down one of the roads now where we should hopefully spot some elephants. And if we spot an elephant and get a photo of that, um, that also counts as gems. But we have to be very careful with the elephants because someone was in this area yesterday and they kept the 100 meters difference from the elephant and the tuk-tuk, but apparently the elephant started coming char charging towards the tuk-tuk. So one of the other guys from that team was trying to direct it another way. And then the elephant started chasing after him and he was running through the bush like a thorn bush and everything, but luckily they were both safe. So yeah, the elephants around here can be a little bit aggressive, yeah, but we shall see if we find one and if we do, Hopefully we don't get tumbled over by it. All right, so we spotted an elephant. It's just on the road here. Just go past it fast. Go, 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 go. Oh shit, oh my God. Oh, oh Jesus. That was, that was very close. All right, so we have another one up here, blocking the road. He's not even moving. So, scary thing about this is, <laughs> they're bigger than us, and they could crush us. So we have to figure out how to get around them. Oh, there's a car coming behind us. 
Just follow up behind this car, I reckon. Alright. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Alright. Well, we... <laughs> we've got a. We've got our army guard. We got our protector. We're just. There we go. Cheers, mate. We're hiding behind the car right now. Thank you. Look at him go. <laughs> Alright, elephant number two survived. Alright, elephant number three. Like he's staying on that side of the road. Is he facing us? Just, okay, floor it, floor it, floor it, floor it, floor it, go! As fast as you can, go! 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 Oh my god! Oh, it's so scary when you're right up close to them. Oh my god, I hit them. Alright, I can't wait till we get off this road now. That's enough for seeing elephants. <laughs> okay, so luckily we managed to make it off the roads where the elephants were. And yeah, we ended up seeing three of them. It may not look scary in the video, but being up and close to an elephant that big, which is like three times bigger than the tuk-tuk, is so scary because like you don't know if they're just gonna charge you. Like elephants are very fast and like we're driving meters distance from them and they could easily just charge straight towards us and flip over tuk-tuks because that it has happened to many people. I've heard stories of tuk-tuks being flipped but luckily we were not one of those people today. Oh. But at least we saw elephants. That was a cool experience. heard about your Entertainment guys story oh, yeah. oh my goodness Jesus yesterday God. was scared, insane yeah. yeah it was insane like yeah. did you run into the bush i ran because because i actually to distract the elephant yeah but because yeah. the elephant was, it was, was trying, trying to attack. it was almost flipping the car yeah, i was like was under like, it like holding it up holding. and it was like down here yeah, yeah. and, and like, then I need, to, I need to distract him and <laughs> this was my worst oh. idea ever because the distraction went fine he, he was chasing me and I was okay, I don't have anything to hide, it's just a fucking road, empty yeah. at all. Yeah. And there was only a forest left and forest right, and I ran into the forest and I was like, maybe he, he can't see me, but he was the elephant running just into charged the forest, straight through the like forest. it was foam, it was nothing for him. I was like, there were so many bushes and trees, I can't barely walk there, I was on my fork. And, and dude, then, and then scary, I was like, I, 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 yeah, I was almost, almost gone. Whoa. That is impressive. Wow, Sri Lanka just surprises me more and more. How beautiful. There's this water, but it's massive. We're right, right up high in the mountains now. The scenery along this whole entire drive is absolutely stunning. What do we have here? A traffic jam. Traffic jam on the mountain. Okay. So we seem to have a bit of a traffic jam on the top of the mountain. I don't know why we're stopped, but I'm just gonna check it out. How good is the view behind me? Whoa, 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 whoa. Not a bad spot to have a traffic jam. You are absolutely kidding me. There's just been a massive landslide. Look at this, look at this. There's huge rocks, oh my god, there's huge rocks all over the road right now. Try and rock right here. Whoa, it's, it's split the road. We're very lucky we weren't driving along here when this happened. Ugh. 
So I don't know what the protocol is now. Dude, you wouldn't believe what happened. It's been a freaking landslide. Landslide? Yeah, like massive rocks and all the piles of dirt. Have, I'll, I'll bring my bag, we can go up, but yeah, it's it's messed up the road, eh? Whoa, 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 one's come tumbling down right now. Oh my God. Oh. Jesus. Still hasn't stopped. Far out, that sucks. There's literally 20 meters of road we need to get through. And now we're gonna have to take a huge, like hours detour out of the way <laughs> to get around and back onto the main road we gotta to get to. And you guys are stuck with me, so. <laughs> it seems more like you're stuck with so, us. So we're all stuffed. So come check out Jess and Hammett's Tuk Tuk. So this right here, this whole thing just ripped. This got bent. And this was all from the um, elephant yesterday. So that's, that's the story I was talking about. They got an elephant incident. And we have just got some news that someone flipped their Tuk Tuk today. So someone was driving along that same road we were going along with the elephants and apparently they were trying to speed by the elephants just like us but they ended up stalling it and the elephant ended up flipping over the tuk-tuk. Holy shit. See, that's why I was saying it is so scary going past those elephants because you could literally just stall it and bam, flip just like that. But luckily they're safe and sound and I don't want to sound like a dick but that kind of gives us a little bit of an advantage because that team was proper tooked and they were second. So yeah, we're, we're, we're a bit ahead now, but yeah, I feel sorry for those guys. Sorry guys. <laughs> In the other hand, look how beautiful this waterfall is. Woo! So this was the very first group I met up with before we even started the tournament and we are all reunited again. Cheers, Cheers. guys. Yeah. Alright, so we're currently heading to a hostel right now, but it is still like 30 minutes away and it's pitch black. It's 6.30 p.m. right now and we are right up in the clouds and it doesn't really help that it's pouring down rain, but we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. We've come to where we think is the accommodation, but we're not quite sure. Is, is there no one even in here? Oh, they've got a TV on in there. We're, we're gonna need to find somewhere tonight. I don't, I, don't, I don't even know if there's many accommodation around this area as well. Where are we? Where do we stay? Where the heck do we stay? No luck in this place, but I think there may be one up the road, so. Let's hope. Let's hope this place is empty too. Hello! Serious? Oh, well, excuse me. Hi! Hi. Uh, yes, huh? Do you work, we're wondering if you've got rooms for nine people. For nine people? Yeah. Nine people. Uh, one minute that he will come soon, okay? Okay. Yeah. Take a seat. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Alright. Maybe we'll be in luck. If not, we've got some comfy beds yeah, to lay on here. We're hoping to pay around 6000 What's the best price you can do? 6000 for a For the whole thing, yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, cool. Uh, Alright, not a bad accommodation for tonight. And how, how about this wall art right behind me? <laughs> So this is actually really cheap, this place, because nine of us literally all just rocked up at the same time. Um, we said we'll pay 6,000 for everyone. So it worked out to be, what was it like? 
500 or no 666 each so very very cheap this is actually the cheapest accommodation we've had so far ah uh, but that is it for today what's the time it's 10 30 now i'm so exhausted and we have such an early morning tomorrow but today was quite an adventurous day like every other single day but he almost got run down by some elephants had those landslides and heard that someone had flipped their tuk-tuk because of an elephant. So, yeah, quite a wild day. But we're going to have to get up very early, probably 6am, because tomorrow we're meeting up at another place where we're going to have a mid-party there. So tomorrow, I mean the day after, we'll have a party and then the day after that is just going to be like a rest day around that area and then we'll keep continuing the quest. But for now, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to subscribe to my channel, give it a thumbs up, and get ready for the next few adventures. Thanks for watching, follow your dreams, and see you tomorrow. Bye.